We started off the year making a sushi taco. Then a sushi burger. And a sushi cake. It's only fitting that we end the year with what you guys have been requesting. A sushi pizza. But before we start making the food, we gotta go and get the ingredients at the Asian market. So many seaweeds to choose from. Let's get one of these. They have fresh udon. Let's get one of these. Komatsuna? I don't even know what that is. Let's get it. Let's get some mushrooms. We must stop the vlog for PSA. What's up, Gatsby? Just made it back home, and so for our sushi pizza, we're gonna be using seaweed, bluefin tuna, maguro, yellowtail, hamachi, salmon roe, ikura, snow crab, kani, shiso leaf, the egg sushi, omuretsu, shrimp, amaebi, Japanese cucumber, kiuri, as well as some avocado. And that looks like it for right now. Let's start making the sushi pizza. We just made some rice. Let's take some out and cool it off. We're gonna slice up some thin Japanese cucumbers using a mandolin. Beautiful. The main problem I'm having right now is thinking of how I'm going to decorate the pizza. We have so much stuff here. I don't want to mess it up. We're going to stick this in our pizza box. I already ate the pizza inside. So we'll have four sliced pizza. We're figuring it out as we go. This is going to make a very thin layer. Hopefully this all works out. This rice is so sticky. <laughs> okay, we just need to do that three more times. So what we're gonna end up doing is creating a sushi in the crust and then rolling it up. So we got a cucumber inside of the crust. Oh, innovative. Keep in mind, these are sushi grade. And now let's cut the egg sushi. I'm gonna try a new technique for getting out the seed in the avocado. I saw this on Buzzfeed. So what we do is we first cut it the regular way all the way around. After we do that, we turn it 90 degrees and do it again. We twist one way. Oh, there's two. There we go. Okay, it was slightly easier. I wouldn't say it made that much of a difference. I think I'll start off by just laying out a leaf. These are actually raw shrimp if you didn't know. They're, they just are orange. We'll just have it spoon <laughs> with the avocado. Finally, let's add our salmon roe. I just realized I forgot the crab, so I'm sticking a few of the pieces inside right now. This is such a beautiful pizza, I feel bad to eat it. <laughs> so many flavors at the same time. I can definitely taste like everything. The avocado tastes good with it. The salmon roe is like when you bite into it, it just like gushes juice into your mouth. <laughs> Some people hate it, I don't mind it. And the egg is a little bit sweet. It tastes good, like the sushi tastes super fresh. And surprisingly, the combination is not that bad. Having said that though, I think my favorite one is still the sushi taco just because the crunch in the sushi taco is just like to die for. Followed by the sushi cake, then the sushi pizza, and finally the sushi burger comes in fourth. Sushi pizza, pretty good. Definitely have to say, not a bad way to end the year. Don't forget, we're still making some fresh udon noodle soup for dinner. Let's start the vlog. Gatsby's like, uh, I'm ready to be in the vlog now. It's time for some hard korg. Double corgi edition. Ready for this? Now that the doggy's exercised, it's my turn. Feeling good. 
guys. We made it back home. Thank you so much for everyone being so patient with us while we were on our holiday vacation. I hope you guys had a wonderful holiday season. Look how many Christmas cards you got. Kawaii, Eileen, Snickers, and Churro. Megan, Jeff, Duke, and Daisy. Hilda and Rob. Zach and River. Colby, Jack, and Spencer Reed. Eva and Wally. I see a lot of you guys got your Corgi on Fleek merchandise for Christmas. Thank you so much for sharing your photos. You guys are awesome. Look at all those photos. Woo! Nice. As I mentioned in the last vlog, the beanies are back in stock. They were sold out for a while. I just shipped out all of the pre-ordered hats. We still have a few left, so make sure to pick yours up if you want one. Available in gray, as well as in black. Of course, you can get all the merchandise at corgionfleek.com. Link in the description below. Look at this, from Eric, Aaron, Jake, Jordan, Jack, Bella, and Haley. What? From Anna, Alex, in Denver, Merry Christmas, Gatsby. The writing is carob, and corners are dipped in yogurt. Chelsea made a 2018 Corky calendar. Wow, these are nice. My favorite one is June. Gives me the Corky on fleek vibes. Hey Gatsby, I'm going to the mall with Sean. Do you want to go? Did you get everything you wanted for Christmas, Sean? Yeah, I got a Subway gift card. Oh, nice. A lot of my gifts for Christmas was pick out something and buy it and I'll pay you back. Oh, that's, <laughs> so, that's nice. so that's, I guess, what I'm going to be doing right now. Gatsby. Gatsby's at the Apple store. This is a nice store. This glass is super thick. Look, iPhone 10 cover right here. A free one. No, it's not a 10. There's a button here. iPhone 8. Sean, you can get it. Ooh. Oh, look, it turned into a Microsoft store. That's, That's where the Apple, Apple store, store used to be. Yeah. yeah. There's Pottery Barn for kids. Because kids care about Pottery Barn. I wanted these for Christmas and I didn't get one for high intensity training and weightlifting. Reminds me of like Marty McFly shoe. We're going into Bloomingdale's. Going through the store. He doesn't know how to take an escalator. He was scared. <laughs> the last time we Is it this fun yet? <laughs> Look, there's Vince's line. Those are really risky. Yeah, white, shorts. white shorts. This looks real like a mummy shoe. Three hundred and fifty-one dollars. Oh, what what a good deal. Y three, I guess, is the brand. Oh, hmm. for three-year-olds, youth. I gotta look for a jacket. So I got a jacket for Christmas, and I needed to exchange it. It was the wrong size. We got it. Free people. <laughs> you should go in and be like, I'm I'm looking for the free people. The free ones. And now it is dinner time. We're gonna be making that udon noodle soup that we bought earlier in the day. I have no idea what it says here. All I can read is udon. We're gonna garnish it with an egg, beef, komatsuna, and mushrooms. Since these noodles are pretty fresh, it only takes three to four minutes to cook. From Japan. Let's first prepare the komatsuna and the mushrooms. Let's try making a star, which does absolutely nothing but make it look nicer. <laughs> if you do it right. I just ruined it here. There's mine. What a waste of time. The water is boiling, so we're just gonna take one egg, just get a spoon, just gonna lower it in the boiling water, and let it cook for six and a half minutes. Let's take some of this komatsuna. I think I'm just gonna leave them nice and leafy like this. Actually, boiling the water. Add the mushrooms, nice, egg, let's add some water for the broth. I cook the broth water separately because it makes it super clear. I got the super thinly sliced shabu shabu beef. It's gonna cook like in one minute. Mmm, look at that. I'm gonna make it all because I'm starving. Oh. We're gonna add our concentrated soup base. Some our hot water. Swish, swish. Add our greens, mushrooms, beef, egg. 
Yes. And there we have it, our Niku Udon. Still steaming, perfect for a cold day like today. <laughs> Let's try it out. Mmm, wow. The texture is like super nice. Some of the greens, mmm. Yes, I've had these before. These are like Chinese greens. Tastes like a bok choy. For those of you wondering, the taste of udon is a little different than ramen. They're not eggy. It has a more neutral taste. It tastes a lot more like comfort food. I'm so happy right now. <laughs> Have you seen bubble wrap? This is bubble wrap. <laughs> He's like, no, I don't like it. <laughs> Gatsby does not like to be touched with human feet. He thinks it's like disrespectful. <sighs> like that. <laughs> Thank you so much for watching today's vlog, you guys. That is gonna do it for us for 2017. I think it was a pretty good year for me, and we'll see you guys next year. Good night. Sun is rising. Never done like a sunrise. Honey. in this huge box. Two Gatsby. What's in there? It's a Christmas Corgi mystery box. Gatsby, should we open it? What's inside? <laughs>